Crafty Friends. I'm back with a project share from Crayspire. And this time, you know, I got the white wax. I got this amazing rectangular jellyfish stamp, which I showed you some examples of in the last video. I think they're so cool. And um, so this time, I'm going to use the white and I'm going to actually put some of these on envelopes as envelope seals, but I'm not going to seal them with them. I'm just going to put them there. Um, I'm going to melt them on there so I can use them for something else. And one of these, okay, I got both of these from Crayspire. This one is a Ferris wheel and balloons, and this one is the bear on the bicycle. And um, I thought they would be fun to, to demonstrate, so I'm going to use. And these envelopes also came from, from Crayspire on another. Um, I'll, I'll see if I can find these two and link them. Um, so, here we go. So, I've put four of these cubes in here. And um, actually, I think I might add another one. Different wax has different um, different uh, like consistency almost, and this particular white is um, I'm trying to find the word like thick, sticky and thick. I think I think that's a good a good way to describe it. So. Let's see. We gotta melt it. It's almost melted. And you want it to melt and you want to keep it stirred up, but you don't want any bubbles in it. If it bubbles, that means it's too it's getting too hot. I think that's probably perfect. So, I'm going to pour it so it's half on and half off. Oh, it made a string, but that's okay. And then... I say I probably could have used another one because it's not going to. Um, so this one I'll put one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to use six in here. And we'll see if that works out better. Let's see if I can peel that off of there. Okay. So, let's see if I can get this off. Because, you know, I can, I can use this wax again if I can get that off. Got some water here. Let's see if that will release that. Yeah, it's coming off. I want to make sure I get it all off because I don't want any of that red to be in there. It's got just a little tinge of color. I think that'll be okay. So then what I do in the case if I don't like, if I don't have enough wax or if I don't like the way it's stamped, I just cut it up into pieces and use it again like that. Now, we'll try this again and see if we can get a better result.
much I am gonna try this again yep I'm doing a video <laughs> Okay, that's not exactly round, but as long as it squeezes out on all sides, I'll be happy. And it's going to. Now that's better. All right, let me put these pieces in here. And I'm going to add two more to it. Because then I'm going to put one on the blue. And um, I'm going to let this cool for just another minute. Oh, yeah. See, that's going to be a pretty one. Now, see? And if you wanted to, you could put a little dab of hot glue right there and it will seal it. But this way, I can add a, a, a little card in there and then close it, you know. So I will also go over that. And we'll try this one. Let me use this as a holder. That'll work good. And while I'm doing that, I'm using my gold pen. Let's see, I don't think y'all can, I put my, my furnace in the wrong place for, let's see. So you just gently go over the, um, the raised lines, kind of turn your marker sideways. Get going. Like that. Oh, we've got a little tail right there. Here we go. Let's see. Let's go around here. Here we go. Isn't that precious? I love it. Okay, so there's that example. Now I'll slide this back over here a little bit. Make sure that my wax is melted. And it is. Now, let's see. Destination. Ow. Okay. I got a bubble right there, but I'm going to pop it when I put this on here. Okay. Now this other one is a uh, is a is a bigger one. So, Christ Bar has all kinds of shapes and sizes. Let me get the wax off the bottom so I don't start a fire. So you can see this one, and here's this rectangular one. And this one is like a, um, they probably consider an inch and a quarter circle. And this one is an inch. Okay. So look how pretty that is on that blue. Okay, so I'm going to put it right there. Oh, let me get some wax in here. So I wonder if I'll need... I'm going to put eight in here this time for this one. Go, go, go. Now, yeah. let's see. Okay, and now we wait. Oh, no. It smells like it's getting hot. There we go. Okay, so of course you can you can use any color on these, but I'm really liking this gold on here. Um, 
But I bet red would be pretty. Let's try a red. And again, I have made, worked myself into a... Turn it on your side and uh, go around. Look at that. I'm going to go around this too. be hard for me to decide which one I like better. And any, oh yeah, anywhere, that's not dry yet, um, like you make a mess like that, because this is alcohol ink, alcohol based, you can take just a little tiny bit of alcohol, I'll show you in just a second, and um, a paintbrush and take off what you don't want. So again, you know, my favorite thing in crafting is to is to say you never there's never an accident that you can't make something good happen with. Let's see. Let me slide this back up here. Okay. Well, that's a pretty good circle. Works turned up right. Stamp it on there. Okay. So, um, if y'all haven't tried wax seals, they're amazing. They add, they can add so much. You know, I've done them with on rosettes, and you can do them on tags, and of course, you can do them on any kind of paper. You can add them to cards, and they make, um, you know, a unique addition. And you can find something that goes with anything. Any theme, anything. Because Crest Bar has so many. And, um, like I said in the other video, they also have the option of you can send them a design, and they can make you a stamp, you know, that was designed by you. Well, how cool is that? Oh, I got that on there a little bit crooked, but that's okay. Just go over it like that again. That's so cool. It's like magic. Just like magic. All right, so um, I want to show you before I get off of here. This is alcohol. There's a place right there that I don't want that on. There's a fly in here. So you take it off like that. And then...
just clean it up. Yeah. And while I'm at it, I'm going to see if I can get this filled in. Yes, I believe I can. Sure, your your paintbrush doesn't have any um, alcohol on it. If you're cleaning, I mean not alcohol. It doesn't have any ink on it. Excuse me. so so anyway check out the link in the description box below and you could look for days on this site I'm telling you they have so such a variety of amazing waxes and stamps and supplies that um, you can do anything so go check them out and y'all have fun playing love you guys blessings